I bought a whole bunch of sweatshirts on Amazon. They all came in regular packages, except this one came in a little canister. All of these are $20 or less. We're gonna try them all on, see how they compare to the Amazon listing, and see if there's any good ones worth keeping for our closets. This one is by the brand Rollum, which I think is really funny because it came rolled up in a canister. It's called a sweatshirt. I wouldn't even really call it a sweatshirt because it's really, really thin. The material is kind of a ribbed material, and on the inside, there isn't any fleece or anything. It's just, it's pretty soft. This is a medium. The arms feel a little bit short to me. A little slit down the side. There's the back. I kind of am getting pajama shirt vibes a little bit from this. I think it's the little buttons down the front. Maybe it's the color that looks like sleepy time. Maybe if you tuck it in, but then you just look like you got a pajama shirt that's tucked in. Just don't love this one. Let's see what else we got. This one is by the brand Amazon Essentials. It's the French Terry crew neck sweatshirt. This is in a medium. You're going to want to size up in this one if you want it to not feel like a tiny little shirt, which is not what I'm looking for in a sweatshirt. The inside is a really soft fleece. If you sized up correctly, it probably would be pretty comfortable. Yeah, I mean, basic, super basic. I wonder if these will all be super basic because that's what you get for 20 bucks. Now this is what I'm talking about. This is the Fruit of the Loom Eversoft Fleece Crew Neck. It shows a guy wearing this, but I didn't really care. I just wanted sort of an oversize. This is more of the fit that I'm looking for than that Amazon Essentials one that I just tried on. Really, really soft. The fleece on the inside is super, super soft. It's like a almost a lightweight fleece, so it doesn't feel like it's gonna be just super thick because I do get really hot. It has a ribbed band at the bottom. This is my style. This is my sweatshirt style. This one, hold on, had 20,000 reviews, like almost five star reviews. This is an oversized fit. I could even go a size up or a size down. It probably would still be fine. This one is by the brand Gildan and this one is only $12 and has 67,000 reviews. It feels similar to the Fruit of the Loom one, although the material is a little bit thicker. It's not as drapey as the Fruit of the Loom one. I probably would have been raving about this one had I not already just tried on that other one because this is a little thicker, so it feels like I'm just gonna get a little bit more hot. This is also in a medium. This one, it's just the sweatshirt material. Same soft fleece on the inside. The sleeves are nice and long, and it's just a little bit more, just feels a little poofier than the other one. I don't know if that's actually true or not. This one is by the brand BTFBM, which if you've been around a while, you know that that stands for belong to fashion beauty merriness. The material on this one is kind of strange. It sort of has this weird fabric kind of stuff. And on the inside, it, it's just kind of soft. The thing about this is that the material is so, so stretchy. Sleeves feel long enough. This is a medium, true to size. I'm not exact, uh oh, oh shoot. I lost the little thing. Where'd that go? Oh, it didn't go far. There it is. I thought it just sprung itself inside the shirt somewhere. So I'm not sure what you would, it's got a tie there. Tie that? She's got it tied in the picture. All right, so she's got this whole thing zipped up to the top, which kind of scares me sometimes. She's got it zipped up to the top and then she's got the tie there. I don't know, what do you think? The material is not super luxurious to me, but it's only 20 bucks. But also you shouldn't buy something just because it's 20 bucks. I probably would never really wear this. I don't know. I don't know means I'm not gonna keep it and wear it, but you can do with this information what you wish. If you're enjoying this video, hit the like button down below. It lets me know that it's helpful or at least enjoyable for you to watch. Thank you for doing that if you do. This one is by the brand Only Land. It's the Cloud Oversized Crew Neck Sweatshirt. This is a brand I've never tried before. They call it Cloud, which makes me think it should feel like a cloud. The thing that is actually feels super buttery soft is the outside of this sweatshirt. It does not feel like a normal sweatshirt. It is really, really soft. And then on the inside, it's a really soft fleece. Something that is takes away from that is I can feel kind of the seams inside. So if it didn't have those seams, it would feel really soft on the inside. This one was actually $21.60 when I purchased it. So not under $20, but close enough, I think. This is a medium, so it's the right size. It's oversized, but the outside's super soft. It feels like Lululemon material on the outside. It's a little poofy on the sleeves, like a cloud. Maybe that's why it's called the cloud sweatshirt. This one is by the brand Basque Dove, and I'm actually kind of surprised with this one. This is a medium and it's an oversized fit. It's got the quarter zip. The zip only actually goes up to there, so then it's split on the top, which I kind of 
like that, actually. The material is just kind of your basic sweatshirt, and then on the inside, it does have a fuzzy fleece. They have kind of a big cuff, and so I don't feel that tight cuff right on my wrist. It just kind of floats over my palm a little bit, and I kind of like that one. It's definitely an oversized look, but it's really quite comfortable. What? sort of oddly like this one. In the picture, this one looks a little more flowy than it really is. It's it's much more of like a structured kind of feel than sort of that flowy, loose look. I really like the little neck thing. No pockets, but that's okay. This one is by the brand Athmilly or Athmile. This is a medium, it's an oversized fit, and it just feels like a big oversized marshmallow comfy bubble. It is really, really comfortable. The cuffs don't squeeze really tight on my wrists. And I mean, I don't know how flattering it is, but I would definitely lounge around the house in this. It's just your basic sweatshirt material, really soft, cozy fleece on the inside. The sleeves are nice and long. Hey, your basic oversized, really soft sweatshirt. This was only $15. It's a little thicker than maybe the Fruit of the Loom one. I don't know if you can't really make this look nice. This is a wonderful sweatshirt for lounge. It's just huge. This one is the Hanes EcoSmart crew neck sweatshirt. This is in a large and I thought looking at it, it was going to be really small, but it's not. And it's actually got quite a bit of stretch to it. I just don't love the kind of boxy bottom on this. It's a little shorter than some of the other ones. I think if I sized up in this though, it would really grow this way and not necessarily in length where it I would want it to grow. The material is pretty soft. It's not too bad. It's just got a fleece on the inside. I keep wanting to tuck it in because of the way the bottom looks. I don't know. It's okay, but I like the other ones better. This one probably looks nicer. This is another one by the brand Athmilly or Athmile. This one's in a medium. It does have a hood on the back and the hood is a really thick hood. Like I would say this is feels like a Lululemon hood and I'm not exaggerating. The material is a really soft sweatshirt material and then on the inside it has a fuzzy fleece. I think I would really like this if it didn't have this tight little wrist band. So I guess I don't like tight waistbands on my pants and I don't like tight wristbands on my wrists. See how it just hugs my wrist right there? I can just feel that and I just want that to be a little bit bigger and a little bit longer. <laughs> the rest of it is really comfortable and I really like the hood. It's very, very oversized and really cozy warm. The sweatshirts that I'm going to be keeping from this haul are the Fruit of the Loom sweatshirt. This is just soft and loose and light, but really, really comfy feeling. I'm also going to keep the big marshmallow one by the Ath, I think this is the Ath Mile, Ath Millie. I, I might look for this in a different color, but it's really, really soft and comfortable. I could see myself wearing this around the house a lot and not steal my husband's sweatshirts all the time. I'm gonna have to try this on another time, but the other one I really, really liked was this one. I just thought the collar was really cute at the top and it's just nice and comfortable and I like the cuffs. For more try on videos where I do the shopping for you and then you can make your own informed decision about whether to try these items for yourself or not, I have a whole playlist and I will link that here. So go check those out and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.